Hi there, my dear friends. It is Michel here from Rapper. We are very happy to announce some new features, which can be found under the Effects tab. They are called the Border Effects. First, a little bit of context. A pattern is made by selecting a part of your sword's image, then piecing it together in different ways. For an in-depth explanation, I would like to refer to the video Rapper Basics, how tilings work and making patterns with them which my colleague Alexander made. As the name suggests, the border effects will add some borders to your patterns. But how? Let's head over to Rapid.app and I'll show you the possibilities of what you can do with it. Now back to the borders effect. We have three different types of borders. Tile, seam and surface borders. Each of them can be turned on or off separately by turning the knobs under the Effects tab. The tile border will mimic the look of real-world tiles, like the ones you may have in your bathroom or kitchen. It is a whole new look that you can give to patterns in Wrapper. Try it out on some patterns you already made and see them in a new light. It is also a great way to see the outlines of your tiles, so you can see how a certain pattern type is repeating. You can adjust the borders in three different ways. You can choose between colored and transparent borders. More on that later. Adjust the thickness. Add some roundness to the corners, just like you often see in real tiles. Last but not least, you can select a color that fits your pattern. I'll show you something really cool for this in a second. The seam border is designed specifically for seam patterns and adds borders only to the areas where you would normally have a seam. This keeps as much of the pattern open while elegantly hiding the hard seams that are usually tricky to make look nice. If you have struggled to get good results with seam tilings, I think this is the feature that will make you fall in love with them. A cool trick on the seam and tiling borders is switching from solid color to transparent mode. As the name suggests, this turns the border transparent. Import your exported image into your favorite image editor and be playful. Add your image with transparent borders on top of another image. Get some texture or gradient in between your borders. Last but not least, we have the surface border. This works exclusively on the surface view and will create a frame around your image. It is a great way to make your image instantly ready for social sharing. When selecting a color for your border, you typically want to match it to some colors that are in your source image or pattern. That's why we've added the eyedropper feature. Open the color picker, click the eyedropper icon and select the color from the source image. Final little trick for you. On seam tilings it is also possible to combine tile and seam borders. For example, with this pattern I vary the border width and color of the tile and seams. So the border becomes an integral part of the pattern. We hope you will have a lot of fun with the border effects. Would you like us to reach more pattern lovers? We would really appreciate if you would like this video, subscribe, smash the little bell icon and leave a message in the comment section down below. As it would really help us to improve our ranking in the YouTube algorithms. Thank you so much for watching and I wish you a wonderful day and happy patterning my friend.